I've just found out, like, almost like five minutes ago, about five minutes ago, about now, that the Beatle himself, Jerry Springer, has sadly passed away, age 79. I mean, as you can tell by this, I, I, I'm just heartbroken. I'm really heartbroken right now. My, my heart is, like, broken right now. And of course, I'm not like, crying, but you can tell my voice, I'm really sad about this. And, you know, as a, I'm one who, you know, as you know, um, I don't know, I just don't want to say, because I think we all love Jerry Springer. We all love his shows. Um, he had the Jerry Springer show, you know, we all know, and he was known, and he had, we had his own chunks, and we all went, everyone was like, Jerry, 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 you know. And it's just sad. It's so sad to see him. We so we've had now had three contestants if you count four Leslie Jordan die. So we've had we've had so we had Bob Saget first, then Leslie, then Leslie Jordan, then Kirsty Alley, aka the baby mammoth, and now now we have Jerry Springer, aka the Beatle. I mean who we're gonna have next? So we have the legendary Paul Anker passed away. Are we going to have Dionne Warwick, Tom Bergeron? Who, who are we going to have next guy in the Martin community? Who's going to, what's going to happen now? Um, or maybe, I mean, also, maybe, I mean, are we going to have William Shatner? Um, leave, and then maybe Dick Van Dyke? Oh my god, if Dick Van Dyke. I mean, he's old, but like, if he dies, he's going to be like, well, where's, if it, I know it's built up, but Dick Van Dyke, he's everyone's childhood, don't you think? And yeah, so, honestly, it's just so sad. I literally had, I found out the news just a few minutes ago, and I, I just don't know what to say. I thought it was fake, but then, I just, I'm just so deeply sad that he's not with us anymore. Because if you remember, um, about, oh, when was it? Okay, let, me get, let me get it up. Oh, it's going to be a pain going through YouTube now. Now, because... I've got loads of videos on here doing loads of marketing content. Uh, uh, don't worry about any of that. There we go. Jerry Springer. Where was it? Where was it? Oh, it's a bit. Oh. This is why. I, this is why I love screen recording. Yeah. There we go. Could Beetle possibly be Jerry Springer? Early guess. Well, let's just let this advert play out because why not? Why not? There we go. So, um. Is there a photo there? I don't, um, don't know about that. There, we'll just do that there. As you know, about six months, months ago, six months ago, um, the night on the, uh, the day on the, uh, the, the episode of Muppet Night, I had an early guess. I guessed Jerry Springer as, like, a, a first impression guest, guest, because all the clues on the, uh, the Martin Hill pages were linking up to him, and I was correct. That was my first ever contestant I ever got before they even performed. And then it was swallowed by Michael Bolton, who I guess to be the wolf hours before the show aired, for Superhero Night. And then he was one I was at, so I got two right. But I just don't know what I don't know what to do now. I just really it's so sad. It's so sad that with Jerry Springer's gone, the person that I go my first ever guest. As before an episode aired, and I'm just I I don't know what to say. I'm just beyond heartbroken. I'm beyond sad. <sighs> Words well, can't describe how I'm ups uh, upset I am by this. Just anyways, rest in peace, Jerry Springer, aka the Beatle. You will be missed, and we'll never forget. We'll never forget, Jerry. Jerry. All right. You, we'll, you're always in our heart, and we'll never miss you.